Hello everyone, I am working as PGT English in KBS. Today I am going to share my interview experience with you all. So I got 54 out of 60 in interview. I think it was mostly because of the talk I had with them on feminist literature. So the first question they asked me after my introduction was, it, it was a quote by Alexander Pope. And the quote was, the proper study of mankind is men. So the question was, why men, why not women, why not humans? And it sparked off a conversation on gender sensitization among students, gender neutral books, and different phases of feminist literature. So I think you need to have a very good command over language and literature. And then they asked me for a demo, which I had prepared beforehand, but then they like suddenly changed my topic to article writing. So I think you, I, I recommend that you should also prepare additional topics for demo. You can choose them from diverse sections, such as uh, reading comprehension, writing section like notice, advertisement, invitation, and then literature section. And you should also be aware of the syllabus for classes 11th and 12th. And uh, I think you should read all the authors prescribed in NCRT textbooks for classes 11th and 12th. Re read those authors in detail. And uh, alongside that, uh, you should also read an NEP document if you can, because sometimes they also ask you, they can ask you about suggestions on language and then school education. So as a, as a, a as a teacher, you should also be aware of that. And they also ask you general questions like what book you are currently reading. So you need to also be prepared uh, about that question. So um, and sometimes they also ask you about real classroom situation. So let's say you are teaching in a science section. How are you going? How is your strategy going to be different from uh, the one uh, you like from from humanities section? So because science students, they are generally like uh, they generally do not treat it as a very important or difficult subject. So uh, my suggestion is that or what I do in my class is that I let them explain it so that they get involved in the class uh, let them explain the text and I also include a lot of different activities to break the monotony um, such as extempore or debates and I also uh, show them documentaries scientific documentaries especially so uh, and include a lot of scientific information so you can you can do that and uh, uh, one one frequently asked question is uh, whether you should teach in english or in hindi like whether you should translate it or not i think uh, translation is a strict no no you should not go for translation just use um, a simple language your word should be clear your language should be clear i think that's all just simplify the language but do not translate it so i think that's all so i wish all the luck i wish best of luck to all of you who are appearing for the interview thank you